hello everyone welcome to simplify this nice algebraic expression and here we have 5 to the power of 11 minus 3 squared uh, so here we uh, write this into the simplified form so now first uh, we write this uh, algebraic expression as in this form so this is 5 to the power of 11 and we write it as 5 to the power of 10 plus 1 minus this is 3 square okay so uh, after that uh, here we use the nice uh, exponential law and you know about this life we have uh, a to the power of m plus n it is equals to a to the power of m into a to the power of n okay so uh, now here we uh, just break uh, this nice expression and we write it as uh, 5 to the power of 10 into 5 to the power of 1 minus we know that this 3 square is equals to 9 and now after this step here we break uh, this 9 and we rewrite this 9 as 5 to the power of 10 into 5 to the power of 1 minus this is 5 minus 4 because minus 5 minus 4 equals to minus 9 and now after that here you see that uh, this is this 5 be the common term um, on the first two terms so that we take it common 5 and the remaining terms are 5 to the power of 10 minus here we get 1 and this is our minus 4 okay uh, after this step uh, here we focus on uh, this 5 to the power of 10 and we write it as uh, 5 into uh, we write this 5 to the power of 10 as 5 to the power of 5 and its whole square minus 1 square and this is minus 4 okay so uh, after this step here uh, we need uh, a nice square identity and you very well know about this identity uh, if we have a square minus b square it is equals to a minus b times of a plus b okay so now we apply this nice square identity uh, to the above term so uh, our above term after applying this identity is written as in this form uh, so we have 5 into uh, this will be written as 5 to the power of 5 minus 1 into 5 to the power of 5 plus 1 and this is minus 4 okay after this step uh, we now uh, simplify this 5 to the power of 5 and we know the meaning of 5 to the power of 5 is that we multiply this 5 uh, on 5 times okay so here we write this 5 on 5 times in this way and here you just use the traditional uh, method of multiplication and uh, you know about this method uh, if we multiply uh, this uh, all of these terms and it is written as in this form 3125 okay you easily get uh, this number after multiplying all of these fives so now we replace this 5 to the power of 5 by 3125 and it will be written as 5 into 3125 minus 1 and 3125 plus 1 minus 4. So after that here we subtract uh, these two values and it will be written as 5 into 3124 into 3100 uh, sorry this is 3126 minus 4 so after this step uh, here uh, we again break uh, this nice uh, uh, numbers uh, so we have 5 into this is 3124 we write it as uh, 3100 and plus 24 similarly this is 3126 and we write it as 3100 and plus 26 and this is our minus 4 and now after that uh, here we uh, again simplify uh, this term uh, so that we first focus on 3100 and we just write it as 
31 is multiplied by 100. We know that 31 multiplied by 100 becomes 3100 and this is 24. Similarly, this is again 3100. We write it as 31 multiplied by 100 and this is plus 26 and minus 4. Okay. So after this step, uh, you focus uh, on uh, both of these uh, terms. And you see here we have 100 be the common term so that now we just take here this 100 is equals to y okay so when you take 100 equals to y then our above uh, expression is written as 5 into 31 y plus 24 and similarly in that case we have 31 y plus 26 minus 4 okay so after that here we need more simplification and now we multiply uh, these factors here so that first we multiply 31 y uh, on both of these terms after that we multiply this 24 on both of these terms and it is written as 31 y is multiplied by 31 y plus 31 y multiplied by 26 and 24 multiplied by 31y and 24 is multiplied by 26 minus 4 okay so here uh, we just multiply all of these terms and we write in this way so now uh, if we multiply 31y with 31y it will be written as 961y square similarly if we multiply 31y by 26 then you get here 806y so uh, these are the simple multiplication or traditional multiplication you easily get these multiplication without calculator okay in this question we uh, we can't use the calculator you just do these all multiplications by yourself so that here you have 24 times of 31 is equals to 744y and 24 times of 26 equals to 624 minus 4. And now after this step here we add or subtract the like terms and we have 961y square so here we add these two terms and we get one double five zero into y and this is 624 minus 4 okay so after this step uh, here uh, uh, we uh, need to back substitute the value of y so we know that our y is equals to 100 so uh, but uh, first uh, we substitute the value of y and now here first we need to multiply this 5 on each of these terms so that here when we multiply this 5 on each of these terms so 5 times of 961 equals to uh, 4805 y square plus uh, when we multiply 5 times of this term it will be written as double four, uh, seven five zero into y and 5 times of 624 is equals to 3120 minus 4. So now we back substitute the value of y and it is it will be written as 4805 into 100 square plus 7750 into 100 and when we subtract these two values then you get here 3116. So now uh, here uh, we know that 100 square is equals to uh, uh, is written as in this form 1 into 4 times of 0. Here we multiply the 100 by this term then you add the just two zeros on here and it is written as in this form. So this is 3, 1, 1 and 6. So when you multiply this term on this then you get here 4, 8, 0, 5 and 4 times of 0 plus double 7, 5. 3 times of 0 plus 3116. So here you just add all of these terms by traditional way, then you easily get a final answer is 48828 and 116. So this is the our final simplified answer of this question. And thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.